sees his scouts. They're only 30 miles from Rome. 30 miles? His speed is uncanny. Of course, he has only a very few men, which makes a fast pace easier. He's not leading an army so much as an armed gang. It is all highly irregular. Unethical even. God, it is not even the war season. Surely he does not think to attack Rome directly. I think that is exactly what he will do. How can he hope to succeed? The problem is, at this moment, we have only three legions in arms for the defence of the city. Surely three is more than enough. Normally that would be true, but most of the men are raw recruits like those who fled from the scouts. The rest are veterans of Gaul, Caesar's men, not reliable. Rome is undefended. My legions are mustering as swiftly as possible. But it will take at least four days to assemble a force capable of defending the city. Caesar is two days away. You touch it with a needle. What do we do now, then? We must make a tactical retreat to the south. A tactical retreat, mind you. Leave the city! You know, cunt, do you run mad? You cannot speak to me in that tone. My friends, let us cleave to the matter at hand. Is there no alternative to retreat, then? None. We shall withdraw to Corfinium and rally my legions there. Once they are gathered and in good order, we will simply retake the city. Caesar has no hope of reinforcement until spring. The towns of Italy will close their gates to him. We will have... An unassailable advantage in men and resources. In fact, this is not a humiliating defeat at all, but a rare species of victory. Calm yourself, Cato. You lack understanding of things military, else you would see that my actions have been perfectly correct at all times. You've lost Rome without unsheathing your sword. You have lost Rome!